You're out there running with the ones. Your thoughts? Um, just do my job. How good's the safety group in your opinion? Uh, I think we have a chance to be very good. Um, you know, obviously, uh, I don't really, I don't really want to judge our group or against put it put us against any other group or anything like that. But I just know that uh, you know we have the guys uh, to get the job done, and we're working our butts off. So that's basically it. Yeah, how much does George add to that group? Yeah, he adds a lot. He has a lot of experience. You know, I think he's going through his eighth year. Um, he's played in a few different systems. Um, you know, you can see he's big and strong, and uh, you know, dependable. So he has a lot. Jeff, uh, we got in here late. Uh, what about putting pads on today? How much you look forward to this day? Yeah, always. Um, you know, we've kind of been we've we've been around each other for a long time, but a lot of it's been workouts and OTAs and. You know, the last two days, stuff that we've been doing is all just uh, drills. We're not really going against each other. and um, But, you know, today is when it really feels like football. And, uh, this, you know, days like this bring back all the memories from when I was younger, you know, putting on pads for the first time when I was like eight years old. And uh, it's just, if you love football, then you love these days. You wish even more hitting were allowed? Um, I think we hit plenty. I mean, it's we, we basically do everything except take guys to the ground. So uh, I know the guys up front, it's it's live for them. You know, they're, they're going full speed. The only thing they're not doing is cutting. Uh, we're, we're doing everything except taking guys to the ground. So uh, I think there's plenty of hitting. As a unit, how much did the Rams game leave this bad taste in the mouth this defense? And it, I don't know if that motivated y'all, carried y'all along coming to the season? Absolutely. That was, you know, uh, Everything that we pride ourselves on, um, it did not show up that game. You know, we really pride ourselves on being a team that can stop the run. When you can stop the run, that really limits an offense and uh, puts the ball back in our court. And, um, you know, when they were able to just run the ball like that, we really didn't give our team a good chance. So, um, you know, obviously it's something that's in the back of our minds. We, we've, uh, we've, we're over it, you know. It's, it's something that you don't want to linger, um, but we learned from it and it's not gonna happen again. Are you helping give uh, Sean Lee a refresher course in special teams? Yeah, I mean, he, uh, I don't know, the last time he's been on punt or anything like that, but I mean, he's a smart guy. He, he knows all the stuff and uh, he's got all the tools that it takes to, you know, play well. So um, I'm excited for him to be out there. What does it say about him and, the, and sort of the team concept? Exactly, yeah, it's just he's willing to help in any way possible and he, and he uh, shows what's important to him and that's uh, just winning and you know, wherever he can help and whatever role that uh, he can fill, that's what he's willing to do. So I think it just shows, uh, especially young guys, that, um, you know, I think Sean's going into 10 or 11, I'm not sure what year, but uh, a lot of guys, when you come from college and you didn't have to play special teams, you think it's it's kind of the forgotten phase. It's like, well, um, I play receiver, I don't have to play special teams, I play running back, I don't have to play special teams. But it just shows a guy who's uh, been all pro one of the best linebackers in the NFL for a really long time, and uh, there he is. Are you aware of him being out here and flying back to Dallas just to be on the team charter? Yeah, yeah. Um, talk to Sean a lot, and uh, you know that's really important to him, just being with the team, and um, you know that's kind of like the that's kind of like the first first part of training camp where we all get back together. We haven't seen each other for a few weeks. We've all been gone, uh, you know, with our families in the summer, and it's kind of the first time we all get to be around each other. So. Uh, you know, for him to be out there is it's, uh, it's important to him. One more. Uh, yesterday, I noticed uh, Cheeto when you ran around the goalpost, mm -hmm. he jumps and hits his head on the crossbar. Oh yeah. Which is like a I guess it would be like a 48-inch vertical. That's pretty impressive, isn't it? Yeah, it's impressive. <laughs> <laughs> Good athlete. I mean, it was jaw-dropping to me. Yeah. Yeah, it's Not pretty so impressive. Not so much to you. Uh, Sure, there's a lot of guys who could probably do that on the team, but he's just the one ballsy enough to do it, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Jeff's been warned about concussions. So he doesn't yeah. do it. <laughs> That's the only reason you don't do it, right? Uh, right. Thanks, Jeff. Yep. Thank you very much.